Hello everyone. Today, we're going to walk you through the installation process of PN Racing Dummy Chassis LED Terminal System. You will need a set of PN Racing 500429 LED set and a 500429T LED terminal kit. First of all, let's remove the car from the base. Remove the body from the dummy chassis. And then we will need to remove the plastic pieces as hot glue to the light buckets. I have many auto scale bodies. Often when I'm looking at them, I wish the lights can all light up. That adds a whole lot of style point and the LEDs makes my picture look much, much better as well. However, it's not quite simple to do such. Besides adding the lights to the auto scale body, we will need a functional Mini Z chassis. First, we'll have to adjust the wheelbase, then you install the specific body clip, and finally connect the LED to the board. And of course, you will need some AAA batteries that still have some juice in there. And finally, you will have one auto scale body with LED lights to look at or take picture with. What if you want to do that for more than one car? Well, in that case, you will need one functional chassis for each car model. Devastating, isn't it? Trust me, I know. That's why we took our time and created this dummy chassis LED terminal system. Now the body is ready. Let's install the LED lights and you will know why you needed this. Some models, like the AMG GT, does have enough light buckets to accept two sets of LEDs. And since our LED terminal can support up to two sets of LEDs, we are going to install two sets of 500429 LED set to the body. Let's install the headlight first. The white sleeve indicates white color LED, which is for the headlights. First, you want to insert the LEDs into the light buckets, so the wire and make sure it contours with the body line before applying the PET cloth tape. To prevent light leak, we suggest to add one more small piece just like this. Repeat the same process for the other headlight. Make sure to swirl the wires and press it down so it contours with the body line. Headlights are done, let's work on the tail lights now. Red sleeve indicating red LEDs, which are for the tail lights. I'm going to remind you guys one more time. Make sure to swirl the wires and press it down so it contours with the body line before applying the PET cloth tape. Exact same procedure for the other side as well.
now the LEDs are in. Time to prepare the dummy chassis. So, this is the 500429T LED terminal. There is a double side tape on the unit already. All you needed to do is to install it on the dummy chassis just like this. Make sure all the plugs are facing up. The on and off switch will fit in the slot and guide pin that's already on the dummy chassis. If you do soldering, you can simply melt the plastic guide pins and the switch will be fixed on the chassis. Or you can use CA glue like what we did here as well. Almost done here. Now let's talk about the battery. You can use any one cell LiPo battery that has a Molex plug. And please note that since some of the similar size drone batteries are made with reverse polarity, please make sure the wire color matches before you plug it in. The kit does come with double side tape for the battery as well. Now you can stick the battery and fix it on the dummy chassis as well. Finally, you can plug the battery to the terminal, as well as the LED lights. Put on the body and the installation is done. Now you can turn the lights on and off using the switch that's located on the bottom of the dummy chassis. You can of course put the car back onto the display and in the showcase. Don't worry, you can still access the on and off switch from the opening on the bottom. I know y'all might have a lot of questions by now. What if the car is in the showcase? Do I need to remove the battery when it's not in use? Please don't worry, we got you covered. Instead of using an IC chip to control the board, we use a mechanical switch so it won't drain your battery even if you leave it plugged in. So we're done here. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and see you in the next video.